All right, everybody, welcome along to stream number three, episode seven, eight, and nine of my Kingdom Hearts 2 Let's Play. Hope everybody is doing well tonight. Um, last time out, we were we went to Beast Castle, didn't we? That's right. Uh, it's been a while, sorry. There's no stream last week, so we're uh, trying to remember what we did two weeks ago. And yeah, Beast was acting kind of strange. Uh, so yeah, we'll see what the deal is here, I guess, and um, what it is all about. Um, we are joined also by Mr. Deathwish808. How you doing, buddy? Oh, hey, man. Just back up on you and back challenge saying hi sitting back back seating that's not allowed how dare you get uh, out of my no, stream no, not back seating because i don't know anything about this game so <laughs> <laughs> but yeah hey hey not a evan a pierce and those who may be in the background can you just um, do me a favor? Can you just check to see how loud your audio is compared to the rest of everything? Because um, LB made a comment on the last couple of videos that apparently you was really overpowering in comparison to the rest of the audio. So could you just check that for me a minute, if possible? Um, yeah, uh, if that's the case, then... LB would say that, wouldn't he? <laughs> it's that's just that's just LB trying to tell me to shut up. <laughs> um, I know it's kind of hard to do that, like to talk and say something and then try and listen because you don't want the feedback. Um. Yeah, I, I can change my game. I mean, I've I've dropped it down ten percent on the actual Discord audio as well, so um, just to try and yeah. help balance it out a little bit. Uh, yeah, I can't really without doing other things. I can't turn myself. I can't listen to myself without feedback, and that doesn't give me anything. So. Okay. Uh, maybe yeah, Curious or Evan turn, can tell us then. The all the way down, so. uh, let me just catch up on chat real quickly before we jump into this. Uh, I've watched the yeah, Walking Dead series once again. The story hits every time I enjoy it all the time. It's also interesting to read the comments I've made and spoken. Yeah, it's a good series. It's a good series of games for Curious. It is indeed. All right, let's jump in then. Let's go. Um... I said we're in Beast's castle, and I don't remember what we was trying to do. Where Which the game? It's never very helpful, I guess. But we're trying to play the game, do things, and push buttons, and walk around. Well, yeah, I mean, I think that that's that's a given. Um, I gotta I'll turn this audio back up because. You're very quiet for me, so I cannot imagine it's particularly great for other people. Oh, jeez. Uh, Audio issues. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I can always just drop it down in post a little bit because it's on a different chat to my... It's on a different channel to my, my uh, microphone anyway, so... It's fine. Okay, how about this? No, it's fine. I've turned you up back to 100% on Discord. Don't worry about it. Okay, yeah, so, I've been saying that I'm super quiet, which... Wow, well, LB, what kind of setup do you have? <laughs> you got the, uh, ultra, okay. the, the ultra... I can hear everything back. There's no roll in this? No, there's no roll. Okay. Uh, Alright, so I've got to try and remember what we were doing last time. I know we went into a went into like the ballroom and there was some fighting that we did. Um, but I don't remember a lot else other than that. I was kind of hoping you would remember Deathwish. 
Uh, that, what do you do if you've been deodorant? Um, um, yeah. I would, uh, or, oh, wait a second. I would remember anything about this game. Yeah, I was probably expecting you to tell me where I was and what I was doing. No? Is that oh, the case? Yeah, you were walking, walking upstairs and doing the thing. That's the thing. Any, um, any advice for this guy here who says that they've eaten some deodorant Deathwish? Have some uh, American opinion on this. What would you do if you ate some deodorant Deathwish? Uh, well, I, I would have to say that I wouldn't have done that in the first place. Because, well, and I have to clarify. Is there a difference between did you eat deodorant or did you eat antiperspirant? Because there is a difference. One has uh, aluminium. You mean aluminum? Uh, if you're if you're from the U.S., it's aluminum. I mean, no worries, Papyrus. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I guess if you've eaten, if you've eaten some antiperspirant, you ain't um, you ain't having no saliva for a few days. <laughs> well, antiperspirant means it clogs your pores up and doesn't allow you to perspire as opposed to deodorant. Uh, it's just something you wipe on to smell. Uh, you know, push over to cover up, cover up the smell of your body odor. Which you know, if you have body odor, odor, it's not really gonna help that much. So it's pretty pointless. Antiperspirant. Uh, you know, it's gonna have. Chemicals and metals and things. Strangely yeah, shaped yeah, wardrobe. Yeah, yeah. Alright, so we're going to be this way. Passed out. Well, Dark Soul, if you've eaten deodorant. Your breath should smell pretty much like an armpit. <laughs> well, I don't know, that's debatable. An armpit doesn't necessarily smell nice. Nah, I mean, but it depends on how fresh. I mean, if you just took a big chunk bite out of a stick of deodorant, then yeah, your breath is going to smell. Yeah, it's not going to smell good. It'll, you know, like, it's Shh. not going to, it's not going to. Okay, I see it. Tip time. I don't have Come on from the door. Oh, I'm so happy you're here. Ronald. <laughs> Sora. Goofy. Hiya. Oh. <laughs> Where's the beast? Oh, he must be in the West Wing. We don't talk, we don't talk like we used to. Did something happen? Yes. Isn't that why you're here? I don't know. <laughs> Not exactly, but we can still help. Since we're here Gosh. and all. Gosh! <laughs> the beast won't talk to you. He's been acting strange lately. The only one who might know why... The only one... The only ones who might know Gosh. why are locked up in the dungeon. I want to help them, but... Wait a second. Who locked who up? The beast locked up his servants. But why? That's what I don't know. 
Hmm. Where's this dungeon? You can get to the Undercroft from the West Hall. The dungeon is down there. West Hall. Got it. Be careful. Wow. Beast and uh, Beauty and the Beast don't talk to each other. That's uh, uh, not a great sign for a relationship, is it? <laughs> yeah, no. Uh, something's wrong here. Should be able to get to the Undercroft from the West Hall. Everyone's probably locked up in the dungeon beyond there. They are, or they yeah. probably are. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, probably. Yeah. Just probably. Maybe. Might be. Probably, maybe. Definitely. Possibly. Uh, I don't remember how to play this game now, I can't remember. Because like the combat in this one is a lot different to the original. No idea what you're talking about. Okay. I see the same crap, I just don't know what you're pressing to do it. I'm pressing the same button, but you've got to be kind of like, there's a lot more like, feels like there's a lot more strategy involved in the combat this time. So certain enemies have certain abilities that you have to um, take on. So you can't, it's not just about smashing the attack button all the time. You've actually got to think about what you're doing, what you're attacking and how you're attacking. So it is about, uh, well, despite what you said, what you're attacking, when you're attacking, yeah. So yeah, so basically, you gotta just watch their attack patterns and then go from there. I think. So, basically, yeah, like any other old school. Yeah. Uh, you just learn what works and what doesn't. There should be a way into the undercroft around here. I bet it's that strange looking wardrobe. The worst hall. Uh, I have to say, Goofy has a real, real issue with taping. Do you mind? Oh, okay. Rude. Goofy has a what? Uh, watching his last run, he has a chafing issue. Okay, so running. basically, we've got to push this while it sleeps, I think. Yeah, there we go. You say he has a chafing while he's running. Yeah, well, when you're running like a sumo wrestler preparing for battle, except a sumo wrestler does it when they're standing still. He's definitely got he was... a bit of a waddle about him. I'll give him that. Oh, no, I think you missed the whole run he did. He oh, okay. Was... Now it's just starting to get a get. Now it's just starting to get comfortable. May I help you? Wu Tang. Huh? What? All oh, right. Bell needs us to go to the dungeon. Goodness, you're here to help my friends. Well, why didn't you say so? Uh, I'm sorry I startled you. Oh, I used to be human, you know, until the enchantress put her spell was turned into a wardrobe when the prince was turned into a beast. The prince is a beast? The beast is a prince? Gouache! That's right. Although his behavior was far from the princely at times. What's this about a spell? 
Well, it was a cold winter's night. And that's enough for now. You can hear the rest when you've rescued the others. It'll give you something to look forward to. <laughs> Anticlimatic. Aww. Hurry now, the dungeon is damp and chilly. Certainly no place for a clock. A clock? You'll find out soon enough. All right, let's get going. Um, if you go into the dungeon, you can get through there through this door. I'll go back to Bell's room. Please help the others. Uh, I can't remember. It's been so long since you did this. Um, I'm going to say 80... That, that, that's the point. Yeah, I know. Um, 82,604. I know. All right. Story time? Maybe? Five, six, seven. This must be it. Uh, what was your guess? Uh. 82,604. Yeah, comparison. 4,000. Closer than you, basically. But nobody is within 1,000. Alright, looks like we got a boss fight. Get wrecked, mate. And Evan is the furthest away. Based on what's been put on chat, Evan is first. is close. Nobody's first. Max guess was. Oh, you come back to life, that's not fair. Come back to life. Killed you once. Yeah, yeah, you've never played a game before, have you? It's like bosses that come back to life and have second phases. What's all this about? Yeah, uh, it's, it's a weird thing that some games do. Maybe one day when you played more than one or two games, you understand the concept. Especially if you go back to like the 1980s. 1980s? Let's go back to the 1980s. Jeez. Uh, I'll take it. <laughs> 80s or 90s. I'll take it. Either way. And we're dead. And we're not going to have any more guesses. So here is the answer. Three, two, one. 75,858. And I was miles off. Yeah, Porphyrus was closest. I won't give up! I won't give up! My turn. Oh. Now, now we're playing as King Mickey. What? The, what's, what's going on here? What? You what? I'm what, playing as Mickey what? Mouse. What, uh, yeah, what? Where did that come from? I would love to answer your question, but I cannot. Okay, I thought you were saying that sarcastically, yeah, but I just was not in the know, so, yeah. 
your Mickey Mouse looks, looks the same to me, but kinda. Fill the drive gauge to use healing light, okay. Um, so wait a minute, can... Can, 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 can Mickey not die here or something? I, I don't know. I, I'm very confused. Mickey can never die. Oh, okay, so... Mickey comes back, kind of like to revive Sora, potentially. Well, if you're asking an actual question, I have no clue. I'm just saying, Mickey can't die. Otherwise, that would be the end of this. Okay, so... It's that. Not really sure what happened, but... Hey, boss is dead, right? That's all that matters. Is it? Yeah, it's dead. This has gone back to now being... Stone statue, clearly. Okay. Oh, well. Yeah, and then it sort of <coughs> evaporates into thin air. Alright, so it seems like um I, I wonder if like the Mickey thing is you get kind of like one chance in like boss fights or something and then you can bring your characters back into the fight, so we'll have to um, see how that progresses um, later on in the game, I guess. Uh, yeah, you would think that if that was um, sure to you, then I'd definitely bring a, 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 th a think, a think. Yeah, it definitely caught and me by you... surprise. I wasn't expecting it, that's for sure. So. Yeah, so that, that means it's meant for something more than what you originally think so yeah anyway. you think the dungeon's past this door come on we gotta set those servants free he's right let's go let's -a go all right before we go though let's um go up here and get these these are puzzle pieces yeah It's farmer and pier impassable. I don't know what the puzzle pieces do, but they piece together the puzzles. Duh. <laughs> There's nobody here. Hmm? You mean there's nobody to rescue? <sighs> Did someone say rescue? Oh, hey, come on, you know, I have to quiet. figure everything out. Oh, oh, they look like someone nice say boys to me. Quiet. We are nice. We're your friends. Oh, yeah, yeah. Bell sent us to find you. Wow. I'm Sora. Wow. Donald. Wow. Goofy. Don't, don't, don't. I am self winding, sir. Oh. I am. It's not goofy. <laughs> I'm glad you're okay. It is we who are overjoyed to see you. Uh, Did somebody you put a spell on there. you guys no, too? No, no, no. no, yes, that's right, you've heard. It was the Enchantress. It seems so long ago. It was a cold winter's night. An old beggar woman came to the castle and asked for shelter. But the master of this castle, that is of course, the prince, Stop that! Put me down this instant! Thank you. <clears throat> the master turned her away. All because of her <clears throat> meager appearance. That's awful. We. Oui. He was a spoiled prince, so selfish and, how should I say, cruel. Luminaire! The old woman warned our master not to be deceived by her appearances. 
Still, he would not take her in. Then the old woman's ugliness melted away to reveal a beautiful enchantress. She turned the prince into a beast, shape she thought fitting for his cold heart. And to further punish him, everyone in the castle was enchanted too. Whoa, that's quite a story. Is there anything we could do to help? Let's get the enchantress. Oh no, dear. We already know what needs to be done, but with the master out of sorts, he sure is acting weird. It's almost as if he's forgotten how to trust others. You don't suppose he's been turned into a heartless, do you? Heartless? If they're a part of this, then it's a good thing we're here. Let's go find the beast. Splendid. Follow me, messieurs. I know a shortcut. I dare say the shortcut will be past those statues that have been impassable up to this point, right? The map of the basement. The map is a real nice um, addition in this game. There was a couple of times when we was playing the original where I kind of got a bit lost, so... Having a map and seeing where things are sure is going to help. I'm sure that wasn't by accident. Hmm. I agree. Please talk to Cogsworth upstairs about the hidden passageway. Napaz, how dare you tell me to hydrate? How dare you tell me to stretch? Ugh. Hope you well, buddy. Hi Good to see you. I hydrate and stretch and uh, hold on. Yoga pose, downward dog, and no, I never it. said. I didn't say yoga. Yoga was not part of the deal. Ah, uh, no, that's just part of it. No, 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 no. Roll over. <laughs> Did he? I, I don't know. I think people are maybe possibly at um, ad break, so I'll just wait a couple of seconds. Oh. I forgot about ads. I don't know what they are. Um, Napaz, didn't you used to have, like, sit up some press-ups and things on your re reward redemptions? I seem to remember. With Deathwish talking about yoga. I'm definitely not doing yoga. Um, your whole apartment has a scent of coffee. You brewed some coffee over six hours ago and it's still inside of your apartment. It's with some strong coffee. Uh, small part. <laughs> Seems all the statues in this castle have become hostile. Please be careful. Yeah, I thought so. Allow our guests to pass. After you. All right, how do we get out of here? I'm afraid we, we won't be marching out that easily. You see, the door leading to the other side is concealed by a sort of contraption. What kind of contraption? Observe. The lantern came. The lantern came down. Indeed, it did. We could, if we could, but light all the lanterns in this passage. The secret door would open. But as you can see, the lanterns are already burning with an enchanted flame. You must put out this enchanted flame before I'm able to light the lanterns properly. Can't you just throw some water on them? I'm afraid that's not enough. But if you use your power of, if you use the power of light, hmm. How about I try using the Keyblade? Bravo! Approach each lantern and use the reaction command Sprinkle to put it out. Only three lanterns left. If we work together, we'll have that door open in no time. Piece of cake. 
Again, it's not quite so simple, mon ami. Certainly, you cannot expect Cogsworth to hang from that handle forever. What? Why, Luminaire, you... If he gets tired and falls off, all the, you, un, all the unlit lanterns will rise to the ceiling again. Oh, okay. Before you can continue, you must see to Cogsworth. Once he gets his strength back, he'll grasp the lever again for you. Use the reaction command restore to help Cogsworth recover his strength. Let's give it a shot. Can I just make like a point here though? It's like, we're going to all this effort to get out of the dungeon. Can we just go on out the same door that we came in and go back to the West Hall? Or is that just too simple? No, that's, that, I'm sorry. Mark, have you been playing this game? Is this this part? Uh, that makes no sense because only because it makes sense. Yeah, there's nothing like a convoluted um, solution to something, is there? Yeah. Uh, um, uh, yeah. I think you're completely wrong and right at the same time. Can I? Uh, uh, excuse me? I think this will be the trick. How come that, like, I don't get it. That just took forever to... I think it kind of forces you to, um, okay. I think it's uh, like doing one of those things where it's forcing you to fail so that you have to do everything they intended you to do. So I've now got to go and um, restart Cogsworth. Wait, I thought all the lanterns that I, I thought the lanterns reset. I thought that's what it said, no? Is that not the case? Um, no, your apartment is 51 and a half square meters is the best way to put that, uh, Papyrus. 51 and a half square meters. That's like, let's see, you all do meters in sports, science. But in houses, we do square feet. So, like my house, two floors with a total of about 3,000 square feet. Uh, square meters. Hmm. Hey, can somebody please explain to me what I'm doing wrong here? You're, Did I miss something on the them. tutorial? You're speaking in metro. Sorry. Uh, yeah, that's that's the main problem. Can't do that and make the game work. Running around, smashing boxes, pushing buttons. Nope, doesn't work. It's not half like this is this is my life, you know. We've we've gone on from walking around pushing buttons to walking around smashing boxes. It's the evolution. Wow, that's we, we have gone. De we've definitely gone to mysterious places. So go here. Why isn't why doesn't this work? I, I don't get this. You're doing it wrong. You're doing it wrong. But what am I, what am I doing wrong? You're, you're not pushing the button in the right way. I'm pressing the triangle button. Ah, uh, see that's your problem. You shouldn't press that one like that. You gotta press it differently. I I'm 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 so confused. I. I'm doing what the game told me to do, so why isn't it working? No, yeah, because you're because you're not doing what it told you to do. But see, that's the whole problem. So, all right, and tell me what what did it tell me to do? It told you to press the square, push it down harder 
to turn it into a triangle, then press it again. Hogwarts will lower the lantern and then you can remove the curse of the Keyblade. After that, Mrs. Potts and Luminaire will light the lantern. Yeah, you basically just need to do what you did, but in the correct way. So, I mean, I think Preferis wants a bit of uh, Gordon Freeman action. Well, I think you're doing that just fine. Uh, for a bar key, same thing. I mean, I, I don't know what else to do here. Because this is just like... I, 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 honestly, I don't get it. It says to press triangle. I'm smashing triangle. That's the problem. You shouldn't do that. Well, I've tried holding it, and I've tried smashing it, and... Don't smash it. Don't hold it. Don't press it. You should... It's telling you triangle, but what you should do is press the. All right, so that's all right. I've reset the puzzle. So, oh, oh man, you ruined everything. All right, so look, I, I I press it there. And he likes that one. Yeah. That was a mistake. Okay, so... Press the... Okay, so... I think the issue here... So, okay, I, I think I know what's going on here. So... Luminaire has to light the lanterns when I break the curse. But I think he's getting stuck on the boxes. So Is this this box? I think this will do the trick. Okay, so I've done that one. Don't do it. Does that so he can get there? Okay. There we go. Okay, so I don't know if you just have to do it in like one go without him getting stuck, possibly. But that was a bit silly, in my opinion. Are we yep. all set? We oui, the secret door should open now. But I don't see any secret door. No need to worry. Just push that block over there. The one that's sticking out. It's not obvious at all and anything. Got it. Yep, yep, yep. Just push that. Yep. That's all I gotta do. Why would that happen? You don't know. Now I must check on the castle. I fear my absence has been too long. I'd best be off too, dears. Watch out for the heartless. The master's room is at the very end of the west wing. I should go on ahead and wait for you. Again, though, we can't like, go to all that trouble to... Um, Go through that trouble to like light the lanterns and and find a way back to the the castle, but we could have just gone the way we came for a start. I <laughs> nothing like convoluted. Yeah. Uh, anyway, West Hall, let's go. Okay, so this brings us back to here. See, convoluted, hypocritical, kind of here in this game. What? Is 
This must be Beast's room. Mr. Beast. Ah, uh, I don't think he's in this game. And the TV show, The West Wing. <laughs> Touche. Ah, uh, The West Wing. That's the first thing I thought of. my out for like triangle attacks on this one it seems like you there's a lot more with the enemies that you can do and they're pretty darn powerful as well especially when you've got a group of enemies let's go back for this chest and puzzle piece Ah, the puzzle piece. Hent. It's quite mad that you can open chests in combat as well. It's like something else that they added in this one. Which is interesting. Alright. Beast's room, possibly? Yeah. Okay. It's time you dealt with Bell. She's the scheming to take know. everything the you have. This castle, your precious rose, and then your life. Trust no one. Feed your anger. Only anger will keep you strong. I've had enough of strength. There's only one thing I want. What? To love and be loved in return. Who could ever... Love a beast. See, she has accomplices. Hey, Prince. So could Sora and those not see the the hooded guy? They just kind of, like, they're not acknowledging the fact, like, anybody else was there in the room with them. And they were just like, okay, we're just going to say hi to Beast. Not like, I, I don't know, it just seems like they didn't see him. Almost like that was somebody in Beast's conscience or like his imagination or something. Because um, normally yeah. they would say, who was that? Beast, who was that? Or something along those lines. So... Yeah, that was quite interesting. Rodia, Massa. So we're gonna fight Beast. Help Beast come to his senses. Bye. Oh, yikes. What was that? Gather energy with successive charges. Need to charge quicker. 
What's more annoying, like Cogsworth keeps saying that over and over again, or... Like him just going, please master, please master, or just like the boop, 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 boop of low health. That was, yeah, I don't know what was more annoying there, to be honest. Cogsworth, what happened? Well, master, uh, you see, that is, how shall I say, uh, actually, um... Well, you've got everybody down there and not dead them. I did what? Eh, uh, you did. Who was that guy you were talking to? The one. Okay, so that answers our question. They did see the guy that Beast was talking to. In black. <gasps> Zaldan. <sighs> That's his name. He came from the darkness. He used my anger to control me. took all my sorrow, my sadness, my pain, and turned it all into rage. There was nothing I could do. I could no longer see the truth. Well, all be. That must be why you threw all of your friends down there into the dungeon. You wanted to make sure that you didn't hurt them, right? Was that it? Was it to protect them? Sure. We know you're good inside. He's right, Master. We've all seen how kind you can be. After all, Bell can see the goodness in your heart, but I'm afraid you've yet to... Bell. Oh, I've mistreated her. I've mistreated her and been so selfish. She didn't say anything about that. She'd never tell anyone of my cruelty. She's too good. You see, I'm afraid he judges himself far too harshly. Why don't you just go talk to her? But... No excuses. Come on, we'll go with you. Uh, party members have been switched, so Beast has joined the party. And Goofy has left. It seems. I got interesting news. One German guy said he took over 200 COVID vaccine shots. Researchers wanted to study his case and they found trace of 180 shots and in his immune system was in competition after these vaccines. Wasn't there, I, I don't know if I remember, I can't remember if it was a German person, but I remember I think somebody in India, there was a similar sort of story where somebody just kept going for like shot after shot after shot of like the COVID vaccine or something. It was really weird and bizarre. Uh, yeah, party commands are earlier command oh, allowed to exchange party members. Use command switch party members during battles where menus can't be opened. Limit list the limit command has been added. Press that show limit and select it. Limit and our abilities that consume Sora's MP and are executed with party members. Uh, sorry, no question, Carol. Oh, no, no, sorry, James. Yeah, no, I actually, I'm, I'm all uh, Yeah, I actually yeah. saw that. Uh, appears, uh, they didn't have an exact number. It was like 167 to 219. Yeah, just some kind of ballpark figure that he took in 27 months. And it, from what they shared, had no. Uh, yeah, it, impact on this immune system so yeah it, it basically give me strength with our sods basically everybody already knew years ago is that doesn't cause any issues compared to uh, we're just trying to fight against COVID, which uh, I've seen my own, my own 
for other um, other people have issues from it after the fact for years. Whoop. Say nope. No issues. I mean, I get that like people want to um, want to like protect themselves and everything, but it's just a bit extreme. Well, it's more than a bit extreme. It's very extreme. Oh, uh, you're talking about the number of shots? Yeah. Oh yeah, absolutely. It's I think the whole point in that was just to say that it doesn't, it doesn't make you more immune. It also doesn't uh, affect you in any negative way by getting it. And yeah, I think it was just somebody trying to make a point. Could be wrong. Could be somebody nuts. Man, I forgot how powerful Beast was. Um, what's when it locks onto a target when casting Fire, Thunder, or Magnet? Knocks a target into the air during a combo with Square. Let's jump down. Donald Fire unleashed a firestorm that attacks nearby enemies. Um, balance. <laughs> Metal loads would think like the whole COVID thing was like four years ago. Like crazy like how time sort of lies by and how different like the last four years have been we've gone from like being not being able to go anywhere to now like pretty much back to normal life but oh yeah you think back to like that sort of time and it's kind of almost must have been what they went through like during the war times and things like having to stay at home and kind of isolate yourself away almost it's crazy oh uh for, for me, uh, so I like think Ferris, thanks for hanging, buddy. Come, carry on, the fish. Okay, hey, yeah. uh, for Ferris, have a good one. Glad yeah. you're doing well with your uh, decent job. Uh, yeah, uh, like what you're saying, it's it's quite ridiculous here in the States. Especially with uh, this year being an election year. It's just absolutely stupid. The fact that one person that's, a, that's been impeached, down guilty of multiple, many uh, felonies, prison. They're still allowed to run. Yeah. The thing is, though, I mean, I'm, I mean, I don't really. As I've said many multiple times before, I don't particularly keep up that much with the news and stuff, but I kind of got the impression last time I did see any news about it, like he's gathering traction again, and it's like he's almost like he's getting more followers than he had before, which is quite worrying. Well, it's, 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 it's the same, same garbage yeah. that it was first time. Second time. Now this time, it's it's ridiculous that somebody commits that can commit so many crimes as president outside the presidency. And, uh, you name it, uh, that they can still run 
to be president. 